hi guys welcome back to my channel is reality check with tata and i just want to say a very big thank you to everyone thank you for subscribing to my channel and thank you for keeping up with me you know a lot of people even have to send me direct messages i just want to say thank you so much for believing in this vision okay so let's jump right into it so this video is just you know a day in my life as a makeup artist in lagos nigeria so i was going to do a job this particular day so i had you know fun you know this particular day i had so much fun that it kind of you know spilled over to the next day to be very honest yes first the weather was friendly you know makeup you know um friendly kind of day and the client was in full spirit i mean her joy was so contagious she was so full of joy and i just knew from this moment that we were gonna have a good day yes because she brought all the energy so let's start working first of all i would like to say enjoy the process of this makeup while we continue the series of be grateful it could have been worse to understand the series completely, I would like to suggest that you visit our previous post to get the full dose. They made the ask, are you here to see Chekube or Chekube's mom? My sister said, no, I'm here to see Chekube. And the maid went in and fetched Chekube's mom instead. The mom came out and I think my sister had to do like, you know, introduce herself. I can't remember exactly, like to reintroduce herself. Like, oh, I'm Chekube's friend and all that. So the mom ushered her in, she came, she sat down. Of course, my sister was still waiting to see our friend Jokube and Jokube's mom went on, uh, you know, and told my sister that Jokube had passed away. And uh, yeah, that was, that was it, um, that moment of silence. You know, my sister was, you know, trying to understand why that would be the, uh, you know, she was trying to wrap her head around the information that she had just received. And then um, the mother dropped another bombshell that she could be passed away two years ago. <laughs> yeah, that was how I was. I was, I was mute as well. I was, I was, I was shocked to my bone you know i remember uh, you know crying so much this day that my star was giving me this story and you know i cried and i felt so bad for the mom because not only did my sister go there to find out that chikube had passed away she also went there to remind the mother of what she was trying so much to forget you know i felt so bad you know I don't know I, I can't even tell how i feel or how i felt or how, how i even feel right now you know talking about it because i mean this was my friend i, I mean any other thing could have happened not to death you know and um, so that brings me to the moral of the story remember i said i wanted so much to be like chikube now chikube is the one who is dead I feel so bad that she had to die but then again i am grateful that i am me now i miss her so much and i don't even to me she just traveled somewhere so no matter who you are or where you are just know one thing for sure you gotta be grateful because baby it could have been worse it mustn't even be a death situation kind of story before you give gratitude to god a lot of times we complain about things that we don't have but forgetting the many things that we have all right i know that this was a very sad story but digest it with this beauty all right In this video this was a wrap and so is it for the story bye